These five cards do similar things, and they are all broken in aristocrat strategies. We have Mahadi Emporium Master. This guy's broken. Not only is he ramp, but he doesn't give an F if it's a token or not. Sacrifice a bunch of tokens and just ramp to the moon. Next up, we have Pitiless Plunderer. By far the most powerful one on the list. Not only does this guy not give an F if it was a token or not, he rewards you immediately with that treasure token that you can just turn around and sacrifice again. Sifter of Skulls. This guy will reward you with a 1-1 one -one Scion token that you can sack for mana or you can keep this guy around. He's useful for ramp or a goad wide strategy. Pawn of Ulamog. This guy's just a slightly worse Sifter of Skulls. Lastly, we have Gadrak. Arguably the worst on the list since he only triggers on instep and only cares about non-token creatures dying. But he doesn't care if your opponent's creatures die, so he'll get a trigger off of that. What cards do you shove in aristocrat strategies?